Virgo. What's up, guys? It's so funny because uh, the very first Virgo video I did, I was bugging, like flipping out Aries style. And it was so funny. That one's got mad views. I hate it. I hate that video, but I gotta keep it up. And um, then I've done like a million awesome Virgo videos since then. I've met so many amazing Virgos after that video. Um, and some of the most supportive people of this channel, um, including other YouTubers who have a significant following, are Virgos. And I'm like, oh my head. Like, I cannot believe I asked the universe to give me delicious high vibe Virgos and you, the, the universe or God or whatever, completely supplied me with the most delicious Virgos in the universe and I wanna eat you all up now. So, this is for my high vibe, beautiful Virgos on this high vibe, beautiful day with Venus in retrograde and Pluto in retrograde and all kinds of retrogrades happening. Um, I need my Virgos to subscribe to my channel so you can watch me all the time. I release videos um, at least five days a week, or I try to. I will be going back to my regular work with um, adults with developmental disabilities soon, so um, it may go down to four days a week, but I'll definitely try and bust out videos all the time for you, um, you know, and it's not always easy, but um, especially for the, the Virgos that I've met recently, oh man, you guys are so beautiful i can't even deal all right be the light yes my virgos um are the light uh, you know this even looks like um little girl lost tarot she is the shit please subscribe to her she's got i don't know i've got 75 subscribers she's got like 90k <laughs> And I'm like, go subscribe to her channel. But really, little girl lost. She's this dope Virgo who looks like this. This is her. She's got an owl of knowledge. She released this amazing fucking, um, amazing manifestation workbook. I mean, she is the hardest worker ever. And that's what you Virgos do. You know, this is definitely for Virgo feminines. A lot of Virgo feminines. Uh, she makes all the right moves. She's a bad bitch. Dude, this reading is for my little girl lost. She is a bad bitch. And I think she's a Virgo, sun, and moon. Yeah, and she's a high priest uh, or high priestess. And so are you guys. So are my other Virgo feminines. You guys know what's going on in the world. You're tapped in. You're tuned in. You intend and you create because you're such hard workers. And that's a sort of like... That's where that masculine side comes in with with my feminines. We both, we all have both. We both have blah, 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 blah. You know what I mean? Okay, I saw 327 on the clock. Um, that is my B-Day. So I am vibing. I am vibing with this group of Virgos in ways that um, I've never vibed with Virgos before. So thank you guys. You're the shit. I am hunching a little bit. Um, but yeah, thank you little girl lost for any support you've given me i appreciate you yeah Ooh, dealing with a strong male strong uh taurus or aries Ooh, you may want to check out that taurus reading i just did virg virgo you talking to a taurus let's see let's see or aries Aries was almost perfect. Aries was losing their mind. Their video is coming up next. So my Aries collective, if you've been watching and waiting, you're coming up next. Um, they want to they wanna trade energy with you, my Virgo. Someone wants to trade energy with you. Someone wants you in their life. Someone wants you, someone wants to get to know you and someone absolutely wants you to get to know them. <laughs> Yummy. And this dude is gonna take charge, no doubt. But he needs to stand his ground. I'm getting that mountain has been coming out a lot for a lot of people. They feel like there's a blockage. But both of you need to be brave and honest with each other about how you feel. No doubt. Don't be afraid, Virgo. Okay? 
Uh, you are stunningly beautiful and you are really, really smart and you need to own that shit. Don't ever dumb yourself down, Virgo. You're a hard worker. You're not lazy. You're the opposite of lazy. You're an overworker, overachievers. And um, that's your shadow side. This person seems stubborn AF and I think you're dealing with a Taurus or someone with a Taurus moon or something. Um, real interesting. Oh, it's getting stiff, mom, it's getting stiff. Call myself Mama Faya because I'm not as young as I look. Oh, two of cups, bitches, yum. All right, nine of wands reversed, wheel of fortune. Whew. No wonder I'm vibing with this, this group of Virgos here because uh, you got real soulmate love coming in. This, this I'm getting like drop your shields. Like you don't have to be so tough. All right, let it like, you know, you can be a feminine here. Like you're allowed to be feminine here, Virgo. Okay, you've got good karma coming in too. Really good karma coming in. So I definitely want you to understand that. Like that you've got that good, good. You got that good, good loving coming in. What is that? What, what the fuck was that? Oh, Virgo, I'm sorry. <laughs> You definitely could be dealing with an Aries and you're ready for your new beginning. You've got good karma coming in. You've got love. You've got creativity. Um, and it may be getting you feeling like a little, like, ret to go. This is definitely a Virgo with some fire in their chat. For sure. Yeah. You know you can do bad all by yourself, Virgo. And, and you've got the abundance coming in. So you just hang in there. Hang in there and wait for it. I'm so serious. All right, what's going on with Virgo's person? What's up? What's with this mountain? What's with this wanting to trade energy? Which to me, I'm getting, again, real sexual energy today. What is going on in the Taurus season? Whoo, 10 of Pentacles, they want it all with you and they're willing to change to make that happen. You know what? I think maybe the blockage may have been a third party, Virgo. Uh, definitely like this person is ending it though. They are putting an end to third parties. They are done with all the other bitches and uh, they just want you. That's a lot of cards. Sorry, Virgo, I can't take all those. One or two more from the bastard deck. Um, yeah, damn. I just got like the chills and honestly, I did catch a breeze here in mass. It's cold all the time and I don't have shoes on and there's a bug on my toe, but um, you most definitely, this person is icing people out. I don't even have any King of Swords here, but yeah, they don't want to hold back anymore. Uh, you might be dealing with the water sign too, though, but they are, wow. All right. Your person's ready to talk and you, you really are focused on you though, Virgo. And, and I understand that. Like, that's how we manifest. You know, you want to bring in what's best for you. No doubt. Damn. I know. And your person needs to let go of these other parties, the emotional unavailability. I'm getting that your person was emotionally unavailable for a long time. And you just were like all set with someone who's emotionally unavailable. And Virgo, I don't blame you. I don't. You know, this person was down with the third party, all that like low vibe shit. And it's like uncool. Yeah. Okay. Ace of Wands, you want something brand new. And that's what you're focused on. You're focused on, you're a queen of pentacles, sweetheart. You are a queen and you are focused. Yeah, you're in your element. Virgo is in her element. She is taking care of her house. She's taking care of her. She's taking care of her kids. If you got any, you're doing what you got to do. Queen of Pentacles is the perfect energy for you with the lady here and the, and the witch. Yeah. Interesting. Emperor. Wow. Okay. Okay. You... It's almost as if... My Virgo is calling in. I got a divine feminine here who is calling in her divine masculine and sitting back and doing her thing. Beautiful, baby. This is delicious energy. 
This is like, I want to be a Virgo for a day. There are so many freaking Aries cards on this side that um, I think I'm a Virgo today. Okay. Uh, you're delicious, baby. You're delicious. And you're everything a masculine would want. You're everything a smart masculine would want. Ten of Pentacles twice. They want it all with you. They want it all with just you. And only you. Ooh, that was a bumbo! I, 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 I'm not afraid of them, but the buzz is so loud. The buzz is so loud. It, it like, and my name means honeybee. I'm a Melissa. And so I'm really confused as to why bees scare me like that. It's the buzz. It's the buzz, buzz, buzz. Ooh. Ooh, this is a lot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna not, I'm not gonna. That's a lot. I'm gonna just see what else happens. That bee was really cute though. I always like them after they're gone. It's kind of like men. All right, hold on. Hold on. I think maybe that's how you feel too. Like, mm, absence made the heart grow fonder, that's for sure. All right, five of wands with the seven of cups. They're conflicted over their options. You know, page of wands at the bottom of the deck. You guys both want to talk to each other. You both are, are messengers. This person just needs to get rid of all the other options and make you their priority. And that is not too much to ask, Virgo. And if this person ever made you feel like that, being in a monogamous one-person relationship with just them was too much to ask, uh, they were wrong and they were probably gaslighting you a little bit. So please, hold your ground, okay? Because this person tried, tried to be a player with you and you weren't having it, and I love you for it. You're delicious. You are a divine feminine. Two of cups again. You might have some water in your chart somewhere. Take a look at your chart. Maybe your Venus or your North Node could be Pisces because you're sensitive as fuck and you're gifted as fuck. Definitely has some Pisces energy in this Virgo. So uh, way more sensitive than your typical Virgo. Way more watery, way more emotional and way like total soulmate energy. You are a soulmate, but you just don't, yeah, you're not accepting anything but the best. My Virgo wants nothing but the best and you're not gonna settle for anything less than that. And I don't blame you, don't. Don't. You, my Virgo is not settling, baby. I am so proud of you. You are standing your ground. The tower and the star. Woo! All right, this person wants to heal this breakup. This person wants to heal this breakup because nine of cups and six of cups, holy shit. They are, that's 15 cups, that's a lot of cups. Guys, June, 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 all over the place. Um, nine of cups, six of cups. This person knows that you're their wish fulfillment. This person knows that you're their soulmate. This person knows they want to be with you. Shit, can I be a Virgo today? I feel like Lulu from House of Oshun. She'll sometimes, I, I'm a, you know, so I'm totally a Virgo today. All right. Um, this person wants you bad, baby. They want you bad. They are nostalgic. They are wanting you. They know that you are their wish fulfillment. You know you're their wish fulfillment. Not that they're your wish fulfillment, but you know you're their wish fulfillment. That is some confident energy. The divine! Ah! I am a Virgo today. I am a Virgo today. All right. The divine is here. And this is a divine connection. And I'm so sorry your person had third parties and shit. That is like just the most low vibe crap ever. And I don't blame you for walking away. You are managing all this chiz like a boss ass earth sign would. You are making head over heart decisions with the assistance of the divine. And I'm not even getting head over heart decisions. I'm getting head and heart decisions. You're using both and you're, you're making choices that are what's best for Virgo and that's it. Dope, delicious. I'm a Virgo today. 
yep. You are managing life. And your person, because of you, is growing. Because of the way that you've handled yourself, Virgo, your person is now growing. And that is leadership 101. Uh, strong female leadership is what I'm looking at right now. And your person is growing and shape-shifting. This came out for Taurus, uh, Taurus's person. A flower is falling all on me. Because I'm a flower child. Whoa, and knowledge again. A lot of the same cards are coming out. Earth sign, this is definitely an earth sign collective happening today. However, what I will say is that your person has the ability to grow and change. They've even got the death card here. Strong, strong Scorpio, strong Aries, strong Mars, masculine on this side, strong feminine. Um, I'm real, real tempted to call this a twin flame reading. Uh, you two have a strong, strong connection. You two are... Um, your person's growing and I think they're feeling the pains of that in a big big way so just bring that earth sign patience that you've got in spades that fire signs completely don't have and um, and you've got this in the bag too just like Taurus you guys are amazing you are being managed by the divine directly by Virgo and that is just delicious so keep it going Wow the video just like Snap. So I love you very much. Again, please like, share, subscribe. Um, you can reach me at mamafayatero at gmail.com for a personal. I'm only 30 for 30 minutes. That's pretty cheap. So consider booking with me. Um, I love you, Virgo. Um, despite what my first Virgo video says, I have come across some of the best people in the world who happen to be Virgos recently. So I really appreciate you and I appreciate your support and, and just hit that subscribe button for me. Okay, baby. All right. Bye.